असलम डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू इंग्लिश ग्रामर क्लास रूम स्टैंडर्ड सेवन वी हैव कम्प्लीटेड लेसन नंबर नाइनटीन टूडे वी शेल स्टार्ट अ न्यू लेसन दैट इज लेसन नंबर ट्वेंटी वॉइस वॉट इज वॉइस यू हैव लर्न इन फिफ्थ स्टैंडर्ड एंड सेकेंड सिक्स स्टैंडर्ड ऑल्सो वॉट इज अ वॉइस देर आर टू टाइप ऑफ वॉइस इन इंग्लिश ग्रामर there are two types of active voice and passive voice there are two type of voices in english grammar one is active voice second is passive voice so see in your book i am reading the example before explaining i shall explain you through this example given in your book number 1 compare the following sentences ramesh made the statue number 2 the statue was made by ramesh in sentence 1 who made the statue the answer is ramesh ramesh is therefore the doer subject of the action make here ramesh is the subject in this sentence in sentence number 1 ramesh made the statue ramesh is the subject ramesh is the doer of the action what did ramesh make therefore statue what did ramesh make ramesh made statue therefore statue is the receiver of the action statue is the receiver of the action and it is the object of the sentence and it is the object of the verb made by the subject ramesh ramesh ne jo action kiya usko statue ne receive kiya रमेश का एक्शन का रिजल्ट क्या है स्टेचू है और ये इस सेंटेंस का ऑब्जेक्ट है ये रिसीवर ऑफ द एक्शन है सी द रूल वन वैन द सब्जेक्ट ऑफ द सेंटेंस इज द डूअर ऑफ द एक्शन इट इज सेड टू बी इन एक्टिव वॉइस वैन द सब्जेक्ट ऑफ द सेंटेंस इज द डूअर ऑफ द एक्शन जब सब्जेक्ट कोई काम करता है जब सब्जेक्ट का इम्पोर्टेंस बताता जा बताया जाता है कि ही इज़ द डूअर ऑफ द एक्शन देन इट इज़ कॉल्ड एक्टिव वॉइस नाउ इन सेंटेंस टू व्हाट डिड रमेश मेक हियर स्टेचू सब्जेक्ट इज़ द रिसीवर ऑफ द एक्शन यहाँ पर स्टेचू जो है वो सब्जेक्ट बन जाता है और ये रिसीवर ऑफ द एक्शन है इसके लिए एक्शन की गई है receiver of the action make done by ramesh when the subject of the sentence is the receiver of the action ab yahan par passive voice mein object jo hai wo subject ban jata hai aur ye subject action ko receive karne wala ban jata hai matlab iske zariye hui ye ye jo action hai ye iske liye hui tab jo hai ye passive voice kehlata hai when the subject of the sentence is the receiver of the action done it is said to be in passive voice in short i will tell you when the doer of the action is important when the doer of the action is important in a sentence it is said active voice when the action or the receiver of the action is important then it is said to be passive voice See, voice is that form of the verb which shows whether the subject of the sentence is the receiver or the doer. Subject ये receiver है या doer है? इसके इसके लिए ये action हुई या इसके जरिए ये action हुई? Of the action performed in the sentence. वॉइस जो है वो ये बताती है कि सब्जेक्ट एक्शन को करने वाला जो है वो सब्जेक्ट है या एक्शन जो ही वो सब्जेक्ट के लिए हुई तो ये दो जो चीज़ें हैं वो वॉइस कहलाती हैं नोट ट्रांजिटिव वर्ड्स आर यूज्ड इन वॉइस वॉइस में जो है सिर्फ ट्रांजिटिव वर्ब ही यूज होते हैं इन ट्रांजिटिव वर्ब्स की पैसिव फॉर्म नहीं बनाया जा सकता जो वर्ब एक्शन ट्रांसफ़र करेगा जैसे कि यहाँ पर मेक मेक जो है वो ट्रांजिटिव वर्ब है वो एक्शन स्टेचू को ट्रांसफ़र कर रहा है इसलिए इसका पैसिव बनाना पॉसिबल है 
जिस वर्ब जो वर्ब एक्शन ट्रांसफ़र नहीं करता ऑब्जेक्ट को उसका पैसिव बनाना नामुमकिन है ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन ऑफ एक्टिव वॉइस टू पैसिव वॉइस नाउ देर आर सम रूल्स टू ट्रांसफर एक्टिव वॉइस इन टू पैसिव कंपेयर द सेंटेंसेज गिवन बिलो शीना ड्रॉज अ पिक्चर हियर शीना इज अ सब्जेक्ट एंड अ पिक्चर इज अ ऑब्जेक्ट वाइल्ड मेकिंग फ्रॉम एक्टिव टू पैसिव सीरीज Sheena draws a picture. Here, Sheena is a subject and draw is a uh, verb and a picture is a object. While changing one, while transferring active into passive, the object becomes the subject. The object becomes the subject and the subject becomes the object. See. A picture is drawn by Sheena. Here, the object becomes the subject, and the subject becomes the object. A picture is drawn by Sheena. Here, verb is also changed. Draws become is drawn. Object a picture has become a subject a picture. The verb is used is drawn by by agent is added here and the subject Sheena has become object. See what's the explanation? The subject Sheena in active voice becomes the object of the sentence in passive voice and vice versa. The object a picture in active voice becomes the subject of the sentence in passive voice. The verb in the passive voice, the verb in the passive form is formed by adding its past participle. By adding is its past participle form. See, the verb in the passive form is formed by adding its past participle to some form. The verb of the passive form will be will depend upon the number and the person of the subject. Passive voice में past participle form ही use होता है और एक correct form of to be is used. Be का जो है वो right form भी इसमें use होता है. See. Correct form of be is also used in passive voice along with the past participle form of the verb. The teacher loves me. Active voice. The teacher loves me. I am loved. I am loved by the teacher. Here, me object has become the subject I. And correct form of be that is am is used. And past participle form of the love is used loved. By agent is used to turn it into passive and to join the subject, the teacher, as object in this sentence. In the above example, the subject in the passive form is I, singular and first person. Therefore, the verb in passive form is am. For example, singular and first person. सिंगुलर फर्स्ट पर्सन के लिए एम यूज होगा बी के जो फॉर्म्स है वो आपको पता है आई हैव आल्सो टॉट यू इन माय ऑफलाइन क्लास एट स्कूल दैट फॉर्म्स ऑफ बी एम इज आर वाज एंड वेयर विथ सिंगुलर नाउन और प्रोनाउन वी यूज एम इज आर विथ प्लूरल नाउन एंड प्रोनाउन वी यूज वॉज एंड वेयर सो दीज आर द फॉर्म्स ऑफ बी and past participle form third form of the verb is used in passive voice second point the grocer sells grain this is also active voice the uh, grains are sold by the grocer grains is the plural subject so we have used are 
आर प्लूरल सब्जेक्ट के साथ यूज़ होगा आई के साथ में हमने एम यूज़ किया था ग्रेंस प्लूरल है इसलिए आर यूज़ होगा सेल सोल्ड सोल्ड थर्ड फॉर्म ऑफ द वर्ब इज सोल्ड बाय द ग्रोसर इन सेंटेंस टू द सब्जेक्ट इन पैसि फॉर्म इज ग्रेंस प्लूरल देयर फोर द वर्ब इन द पैसि फॉर्म इज वेयर That is plural plus past participle form of sell. Sell that is sold. Now come to the next page. See the simple tense. The simple in simple present tense. How we shall change the active voice. Passive form of simple present tense is formed by gi as given below. Subject plus is R M plus past participle by the uh, plus by plus object. That is the formula of pa uh, passive voice for present simple tense. If the sentence is simple present tense. If the sentence is in present simple tense, the formula will be subject plus M is R plus past participle plus by plus object. See the first example. Children break toys. Children, children break toys. Toys plural subject. Toys. फिर हम यहाँ पर use करेंगे helping verb R. Toys are break का past participle form broken. Toys are broken by the children. By with the plural sub subject that is children will become the object. Toys are broken by the children. Toys are broken by the children. That is the passive form. Second example, my mummy admires me. Active voice. Subject. My mummy. Verb admires. Object me. Here the object me will become the subject. अब me को subject बनाएंगे तो first person subject में क्या use होता है I. Subject में me use नहीं होगा Subject me का subject क्या बनेगा I बनेगा In the lesson pronoun we have learned that the pronouns are used particularly. Some pronouns are used particularly at subject plus and some pronouns are used particularly at object plus so the subject of the pronoun me will become i i am admired admire ka third form admired by my mummy i am admired by my mummy so that is the interchange of present simple tense sentences into passive voice in present simple tense we use am is r plus past participle plus by plus object that is the formula you shall practice this at home write at least 10 examples of present simple tense sentences and then change into passive voice then change into passive voice that is a homework for you for today i shall stop here have a nice day allah hafiz and goodbye